My right hand man, Dooley, took some time off. He was concerned about his family, wanted to stay home this week, which we were honored to let him do that. But we're trying to keep running, so I am setting up. This is the flash tank for our uh, vacuum bleacher. Uh, so this tank to the next us here, this is uh, a jacketed vessel that heats the oil up and uh, we pull it under vacuum. The purpose of this is just like a shop vac. Shop vac creates suction, you need something to catch the suction stuff if there is something that comes out of it. I'm not sure what to expect, but maybe some water that comes off this oil, some moisture during the distillation process, or potentially some volatile compounds that might be part of what's in the oil. But this tank serves as a vessel to catch it prior to it going into the vacuum pump, which is kind of a nice situation. It, it keeps the stuff away from the vacuum pump. Pretty exciting. Hopefully got a prototype run this thing today, and uh, we're going to know if our new bleaching vessel works as I think I designed it. Could be an interesting situation. Can you tell us more about what you meant earlier when you said distillation? Uh, well, it's not true distillation. So basically, we're pulling this vessel under vacuum, which will cause like water, for example, will then turn into a vapor at a much lower temperature than it normally would. So when we're at full vacuum, water will boil and turn into a vapor at about 80 degrees. If there is water mixed in the oil for some reason, it will vaporize and come off and get captured in this, in this vessel right here. Also, while it's under vacuum and at a modified temperature, some of those volatile compounds may vaporize and may get sucked out of there as well some of the decomposition products, some of those things that could potentially lead to oxidation or may be a result of oxidation. What, why is oxidation bad? Well, oxidation creates off flavors and smells in the oil. Um, so as the triglyceride breaks down, it will create some of these side products that kind of give an off flavor and off taste. In terms of safety, those oxidation compounds are, are perfectly safe you know, in small quantities, but obviously we're trying to make the absolute best product that we can make here. So being able to suck them off of the oil with an apparatus like this gives us the opportunity to make the very, very best product as possible.